Hey guys. Manson looking probably here. Sorry I haven't been showing you any pickups. December and January I was kind of light of money. And I didn't get any DVDs Christmas. So I'm gonna take a look at what you did. But I'm back. I've got a little bit of catch. A little bit of a stack, if you will, of DVDs. Yeah, it's not a, a big stack, so it's like one or two titles. Stone Hill. Oh yeah, we really had twelve titles. No, I'm gonna take the time to use these to actually do a cycle rangers, and I want to show people how to get their start. Oh. This is what I picked up. A huge pack of movies. Pure Terror. You can see that. And all the movies that's on the back. This, if you really want to get a start, you want to get a leg up on being a psychonaut, and you want to collect stuff from the psychotronic, this is where you can start. Easy. Okay. I got pure terror, sci-fi invasion, all of these films, and I got these. history films, Ooh, history classics, Ooh, not a good one, Smith, not an awesome one. Quickest way to get your start. I mean, yeah, you can buy them one at a time, but they're like five to seven bucks each if you go through Alpha Video. Yep. I'll show you. I'll show you how I got my start. I got my start with these. These right here. Can you see this? Fifty Horror Classic from Tree Line. These cost me a little bit. This one's really gonna beat up. My science class. My tech class. And it had like a door. These are the really ridiculous Velcro doors. And each. Each disc had two sides, like a record. And like a record sleeve. You can pull them out and watch. Yeah, but these are mine. These are how I. These are, this is the first stuff I got. Right here. This is how I started. Yeah, and it's got a lot of good films on it. So everyone, everyone sees filthy pack and think, ah, ridiculous, stupid shit. Right? I got this for Night of the Living Dead, which is on here. I got this for White Zombie, uh, Nosferatu, Phantom of the Opera. The Bat, Last Woman on Earth, Last Man on Earth, Dementia 13. Um, a lot of good movies were on this thing. The same thing with sci fi classics. I have gotten it for uh, the American Amazing Transparent Man, Horrors of Spider Island, Horrors of Spider Island, Wasp Woman, uh, Bride of the Gorilla. Um, the Phantom Planet. Shitload of Hercules movies, so I was in for it. Another reason why we should get get into these. By the way, I love how we advance with the plastic packaging. I just want to my face on here. And then, and then, well, yeah, I kind of miss the old cardboard sleeve for for this. And you got my paper sleeves for your dual sides. They give you a booklet. Booklet. And it tells you what's on each disc and everything. That's kind of cool, you know. I'm kind of nostalgic for the sleeves. But, this is the quickest way. If you go on Amazon, you can get these. 25 bucks. Well worth it. I've got these, interestingly enough. Walmart is having a nationwide sales of these things. Don't know why. 
don't care why. I'm getting a lot of good movies. I'm getting a lot of shitty movies out of this. Cheapest way, though. The cheapest way to get your start. Don't cost you nothing. You're getting 53. You're getting 50 free movies. You're already ranking up your, your, your DVD collection. And then when they do special editions, like... Uh, uh, Nightmare Castle. Nightmare 7 films did a, a Nightmare Castle special edition. And of course, you know about Metropolis. So if you, those come out, you have a loaner copy you could loan your friends and not feel as bad as getting but this is all public domain. Way to start it up. Another reason is, is really, when you think about it, who's going to do a special edition of Man of um, Well, strike that. <laughs> strike that, strike that. Um, I'm pretty sure Demi Moore isn't going to sit down and do a special edition of me. Okay. That's another thing. That's another thing. You're getting a lot of firsts out of this. You know? Um, off my mind right now. Grave of the Vampire was created by the was written by the guy who created the Sopranos. His name escapes me now. But the guy who created the Sopranos. His first job was writing Grave of the Vampire with William Smith playing a really unconvincing vampire. Tony and Daddy are playing. I will. Yeah, you got these. And then, it's not just you know, horror, sci fi. You, know, you can bridge off and converge into different subgenres too, like uh, the martial arts genre. I've got about good. Let's see. Let's see. It says 23 hours, but I think that. Yeah. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I got. Good 16 films out of these. And, and it's like the rest. You know, little paper. And it's not double side. So. And some of these aren't double side either because I know this one isn't double side. And the other one isn't double side either. Mystery is. And then you can branch off to genre that it was like. Sunichi Chiba, Sunichiba, Street Fighter, Return of Street Fighter, The Bodyguard, my personal favorite. I love The Bodyguard. Don't let anyone tell you any different. Not only is it my favorite comic book movie, it is a comic book. It's better than stuff with Karate Kiba. Um, it's got the best shot I've seen of 47th Street, Times Square. Best brilliant shot of 40 seconds you can times square. Yeah, gotta catch that one. Gotta catch that one. Yeah. Yeah, even three packs. Now this is a three pack. It has very hard to get movies. Yeah, I, I got this one for uh, Global 13. I'm not a comic book movie. Um, that's pretty much it. Folks are your friends. They'll help you get up there in the DVD. I count these as I have over 300 films out of these boxes. Almost 300 films out of these boxes that are sitting before me. A lot of movies. A lot of good movies that are on public domain. Um, as soon as they get special, you can make these loaner copies. They're really a lot of fun. It builds your, your intellect. A lot of first for a lot of people. As I said, the new war was part of the first movie was Mutant. Um, a, lot of, a lot of first for directors too. You know, the terror was pretty much Coppola's first movie, as well as Jack Hill's. Um, but that will get you well on your way, well on your start. 
and then you build off of that. Like you like if you like the tarot, if you loved um let me pick up some. If you loved Attack of the Giant Nature's, if you loved Cats Meow, Phantom of Ten Thousand Leagues, look for the American International Pictures. And that'll get you that's the production company that made all almost all of the uh, driving films of the fifties. That was that was the company that started the Quad House. The, the rebirth of the inner urban of theater houses, which were grind houses at the time. And that was the category. You know, and then you build off to the guy who first started successfully, Mario Baba. Um, you know, if you like silent pictures, there's a lot of silent pictures in these things. So Dr. Jack and Mr. Hyde, Nosferatu. Yeah, the Hunchback of Notre Dame. How about that? And you can expand on the box sets too. I still gotta give you a couple box sets. Uh, I'm not there on the box sets yet. I still got a lot of stuff to re reown and everything. But yeah, where'd you guys go? These are with my cat. I'm very proud to get them. And I hope to get at least one or two more from Mill Creek. Mill Creek's a good company. And that's how you make your start. I hope you liked it. And I hope that was very informative. Thanks. Bye.